everyone so today i wanted to review and spot for you ofra cosmetics lasting liquid lipstick um, i have three of those and i will swatch them for you they come in a really nice black cardboard slick packaging the name is on here now um ofra is something new to me um i've just heard a lot of people talking about it how comfortable those lipsticks are because as you know there is a craze about uh, liquid lipsticks matte lipsticks and i have tried a few latest being next the lingerie line and they were awful i like the look of um matte very saturated lip something that is long lasting um, I just think that matte lip looks more polished as if you put much more effort into applying your liner your lipstick but unfortunately most of them are so dry and so uncomfortable and they almost crack and peel and if you try to reapply it it's a nightmare so after very long research and uh, looking at thousands and thousands of swatches because even when you look online or or on youtube everybody has different lighting and it's very hard to find the swatches so now this lipstick is matte but it doesn't stain your lips like a lot of matte lipsticks liquid lipsticks stain your lips this one doesn't it's very easy to remove i've tried some liquid lipsticks that the only coconut oil would, would remove these are really easy to remove but they do stay on your lips for a very long time they have antioxidants in them and vitamin e i think in the us they cost 19 dollars 90 um, and I have found for us here in the US a shop that sells them, internet shops. So I will leave all that below in the um, description box. This lipstick feels really, it's very mossy, it's very lightweight. Um, as soon as you put it on your lips, it goes on really creamy, then dries down a bit. And then you feel like you've got nothing on. When you put your lips together, it doesn't feel awfully dry. I just absolutely love them and um, I have been wearing them probably for a week now. I've just ordered one at first to try because I think in here they retail for about 16 or 17 pounds. Um, so I thought I'd just try one but when I tried that one I thought I need some more. But I am still a bit afraid to try those in your face uh, colours but they have plenty of uh, very neutral ones neutral pinks neutral beiges neutral neutral brown so there is something for everyone and there is plenty of reviews and um, swatch videos here on youtube so this one does not crack i have had one liquid lipstick from some unknown company i think they've sent it to me and when i applied it it went on really creamy but when it dried it looked like a chalk paint it was just awful my lips looked like someone put chalk paint on it paint on it and they were cracking and when you're eating as well they sort of wear off here and leave you with that terrible line that's another thing Ofra um, lipsticks wear off really nicely and they they don't claim um, they claim that uh, these lipsticks will last on your lips for five hours if you don't drink and eat and I totally agree with that I probably get five hours out of them even if I'm drinking and eating but of course they will wear off a bit in the middle another great thing about them is that re reapplying is so easy sometimes with liquid lipsticks once they've dried down and worn off a bit when you try to reapply it they go on patchy and it's just a big mess this one is fabulous so what I'm going to do I will go from the lightest to darkest I have three colors the lightest is the Angelus I will swatch them on my hand as well for you because another great thing about them is you can layer them you can mix the colors and I've been doing that as well and you get totally different looks so um, and they are really good at um, layering color on top of a color okay so I have those three 
So always make sure that your lips are well exfoliated and uh, what I do, I put balm on while I'm doing my makeup and then I take a towel and wipe the balm off. Just so I have a bit of moisture on my lips. The first one is Angelus. And Angelus is very, very pale, pinky nude and this one what I really like about it has almost pearlized finish to it slightly pearlized so it's really really odd because it is matte and it feels matte but it has a bit of that sheen so this is Angeles okay now this one is very very pale so you can wear it on its own obviously you can um, put it on top of another liquid lipstick or you can use lip liner these li lipsticks are brilliant because you don't really need lip liner you can draw a line with the doll foot applicator and you know it will just stay put there but i would use with this one lip liner so about sh let me show you without lip liner When you put your lips together it feels just so lovely and soft and I don't know if you can see that this one has that slight sheen to it. So this is Angeles and as you can see it is very very pale nude pink. Now if you want to put a um, slight lip liner around it I would wait till that dries obviously so it's nice and matte and then I found for example it's cosmetics and your lips by better nude lip liner um, or you can put something a bit darker and blend it out. Let's have a look. You could not, not do that with the ordinary lipstick, the lip liner wouldn't go on afterwards, but because this is dry now. Okay, so that's with the lip liner. This is all dry now. I wouldn't say they dry completely. They almost feel, after about five minutes, light as air like you've got nothing on your lips and um, yeah it is completely matte love this one if you've got very dark olive skin that will look obviously much brighter if you are very pale it will look a bit darker on you okay so that was angeles well let me just show you i'm just taking it off with a um, makeup wipe and I've got no problem with it coming off whatsoever okay the next color I will show you is Laguna Beach so this is Laguna Beach and Laguna Beach is <clears throat> sorry it's still nude it's like a neutral pink I would say Beautiful colour. Can you see now that Angeles that it's got a bit of a sheen even though it's dry? Okay, let me apply the Laguna Beach. This is 
almost like your lips felt better. And you see with the point of the applicator, you can make a lip line. So this is Laguna Beach, very very wearable everyday colour, like I said it's a bit like your lips but better, well a bit more pinker. Yeah I can still feel it quite soft but I've put a couple of layers on, but as you can see I don't think it looks very drying, um, it just looks like very very saturated colour and matte but feels very comfortable it doesn't feel sticky it just feels like you've got nothing on your lips okay let's try the third and last one so the last one is Pasadena or Pasadena and this one is very similar to Laguna Beach but a bit more browner and a bit darker so let me apply that. This one is actually a bit like your lips are better, but I think this one um, becomes a bit darker when it dries. So this is Pasadena. So this is Pasadena. So again, Angeles, Laguna Beach and Pasadena. Now I wanted to show you that you can mix them. So you could, I've done before, um, I've applied Angeles, for example, the lightest one and topped it off with Laguna Beach or other way around. So let me show you when I apply the An Angeles on the top of Laguna Beach. It's sort of mutes the colour and mixes together really well. So this is Laguna Beach on its own and this is uh, Laguna Beach topped off with Angeles. So as you can see it changes the colour. So out of three lipsticks you can get so many looks. So my final thoughts are I absolutely love them. I never thought I would find a liquid lipstick that I really enjoy and I'm really thinking of getting some more. I have been wearing these on and off all week and sometimes I wear all three just changing them because I enjoy them so much. Um, I think I might order some other colours but I'm a bit scared of the more loud colours as they are so opaque that they are very in your face but um, I will have a look at some more swatches and we will see. Okay so this was my review of Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick. I hope you liked it. Thank you very much for watching and I see you soon. Bye!